Tina. Come on, keep your eyes closed. Keep your eyes closed. Wait, you're gonna love it. You're gonna love it. All right, stop. Open your eyes. Welcome to Laura and Tina's doggy wash. I thought you said you got an office space. What? Well, you gotta use a little imagination. I mean, look, check it out. I've already got organic shampoos, energy efficient blow dryers. Oh, look, and little cotton towels to dry the food doggies. Yeah, but what about the essential things to running a business, like email, and internet access, computers, and like a toilet? Um, right. <sighs> well, uh, look, you got a printer. Oh, 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 and the lady who leased us this space said she left us a server, right? Come on, it's over here. It's gonna be great. All right, look, Tina, here, check it out, check it out. Look, she left us a server, instruction oh, manuals, this, this is not a server, this is a Commodore 64. Really? Yeah, there's no floppy. It's, it's really Tina, inspiring. it's got 64K. Okay, look, Laura, at minimum start a business, we at least need email and I am. Well, I just figured that this would, and you mean I can't sync my phone no. with this? No, okay, Laura. It's got instructions. I okay. can't sync my phone? Look, how much money do you have right now to start our business? Okay, so look, after I went and I got all the doggy yeah. supplies, and then I, got, I rented us this space, right? Yes. How much so money? So, we have got... Wait, that's it? You can't start a business on that amount of money. How can we get things like Word and PowerPoint and Excel? I don't know. Oh, this is so not good. Well, oh. I got really good shampoo. This is Uh, I guess you're not open for business yet. No, I mean, we don't have any of the right stuff for like behind the scenes computer software. Oh, I'm sorry, you said software. Uh, yeah. have, you, have you heard of Office 365? No, what is that? Oh, it's, it's a new service from Microsoft. It combines uh, Office products with uh, big business class web services. You just use your own computers and phones. So is that the thing in the cloud I keep hearing about? Well, when you hear the cloud, think of online. We do our banking online. We upload pictures to the web. So Office 365 is like having your own cloud just for your business. Okay, but I'm a really small business. I gotta be honest, we don't have much money to get started. That's where it works really well because it's just a monthly subscription fee. Oh. It's probably less than your cell phone bill. So like right away, can I get going with like email and I am? With uh, email, you get two of the big corporations use called Exchange. With Exchange Online, you get reliable, commercial-free email that you use through Outlook. And then for IM, you get Link. Link's like IM on steroids. You can chat with text and you can chat with audio, but also video. You can start an online meeting. You can even share your desktop with folks. So where do I keep all this information? We have like a Commodore 64 we're going to use as a server. <laughs> well, that's where SharePoint Online comes in. That's about uh, online storage and building websites. So you can build your internal site for your employees that you'll have soon. Yeah. You can share documents and build team sites. And then it can also build your external site, the one the customers see, and link to all that information. Okay, so now can you also explain to me what web apps are? Web apps are online versions of Office, so Word, Excel, PowerPoint, OneNote. You can get accessible to any time you have an internet connection. And if you already have Office, it just works seamlessly with those. Doug, this is great. So how do I get started? Do you have an online connection yet? Yes, I have internet access. Okay, now. well, you're great. All you have to do is go to office365.com. You know, there's a start button. You can start right now. Doug, thank you so much. Your first dog wash is on me. I'm going to go get started. You hear that, Bella? You're going to get a free dog wash. Bella. Oops. Free dog wash. So, Mr. Chester, I heard that Link was like, I am on steroids. Well, I've been on steroids, and I can't set up meetings or, or share my desktop, but Link can, although uh, sometimes I can call somebody. Well, that's an excellent question, Scooter, considering what the steroids have clearly done to your brain. So, I've installed Office 365 and I've got my user account set up. Hey, right, Alyssa! Here. Hi, guys, how are you? Yeah. Listen, I've got this up and running, but if you could show me some of the really cool stuff that Tina and I can do with it, then maybe, you know, she won't kill me. All right, so this is Outlook. And Outlook is a great way for both you and Tina to stay in touch with your email, with your calendar, and your contacts. Okay. You each have your own Outlook account, but one of the great things about Office 365 is that it's really easy for you to share all of that information as well. Cool. So you can see you've got all sorts of things that you can do. You can send emails, you can send instant messages, you can um, set up your calendar. This little jelly bean, we call it right here, uh -huh. is a presence icon. And you can see right now that Tina is green. 
Um, that means she's online. She okay. might be somewhere else. She might be at her house right now, but she's online. Really keeping tabs. What is, I guess the yellow means? Yellow means she might be away. away. Red might be she's on a phone call, something like that. Great. So super easy That's to see cool. that she's online and available. And really easy for you straight from this presence icon to quickly fire up an instant message, set up an online meeting, contact her by email. Really, really easy for you to get in touch with her. It's pretty cool. The other thing I wanted to show you was you have um, all of that same rich functionality in what's called the Outlook web app. So if you happen to be on a client site or in the library or somewhere else where you're not at your regular PC and you're just accessing Office 365 over a browser, okay. you've got all of the same rich functionality that we just showed you in Outlook on the Outlook web app. So again, you can see presence icons, you can you know look at shared calendars, you can see here's your calendar and here's Tina's calendar straight from the web. So I see I still have the jelly beans. Does it sync my schedule, beans. my contacts? Your, all of your schedule, your contacts, your Great. email, everything is always up to date. Same thing from your mobile device. One of the cool things about Office 365 is you've got access to all the Outlook information on your mobile phone. Hmm. So I know that you do a lot of scheduling of all the dog wash appointments. So if you're sitting here doing all the schedules, Tina can just have her mobile device with her and if you type in the address of where she needs to go, uh -huh. it's very easy for her to just, within that meeting request, pull up the directions to the new dog wash appointment, and she's good to go. She doesn't have to worry about anything else. All of that information she needs to get work done is just on her mobile device. All right there, all on your phone. Exactly. Always up to date. So there's no excuse for Tina to miss a dog wash then. No excuses. Perfect. All right. All right. Thank you so much. Let's get Gus washed. All right. Let's go. All right, so I've got email and IM, but now I need a way to make my docs and office applications available anywhere. If I were clever, I'd have some kind of an online storage. Knock, knock. Perfect timing. You don't have to be clever to set up online storage in Office 365. George and I will show you how. Now, you and Laura work as a team, so you need a shared list of tasks. Mm -hmm. So let's start a shared to-do list of things for you. Things you need to do today. Okay. We can create a OneNote notebook right here in your team document library. Now, this opens right up in the browser, so you can get to it from anywhere that has an internet connection. No matter where I am. Exactly. Now, I'll just set up your to-do list, and here's a time saver. OneNote creates tables automatically when you hit the tab key. <laughs> now, as you're going through your day, you can add items and update the list, and anyone else can, too. So if Laura's, say, washing her dog somewhere in Redmond, Mm -hmm. And she makes changes on her phone. I can get them here on my computer? Exactly. Oh, OK. This is perfect, you Jessica. Can, you can even work on it at the same time. So no more confusion about who's supposed to so do what. awesome. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. Now, can you point us to a good lunch deli? I'm thinking about a nice onion parmesan frittata today. <gasps> oh, my goodness. You're craving one of my favorites. Oh, I might have a nibble. But really, it's for George. He gets peckish when we go walkies. Happy scrubbing. Can I come? So between OneNote and Office Web Apps, our documents be stored online, so we can get them from anywhere. Mmm, if we can get that and an onion parmesan frittata, I'm in. I'll tell him to use fresh herbs only. Hey, hey, okay, so look, so the cloud storage is set up and all of our documents are available whenever we need them. You rock! You rock! Hey, what's the paper? Oh, yeah, girl, we got competition. They were handing this out at the local dog park. Big, huge dog wash conglomerate? I know, I know. Check the inside. Wait, let me look up their website. Fully automated machines, all dogs untouched by human hands? That's just wrong. OK, it says wrong. here that they're headquartered back east, and they've got dozens of locations across the country. What? But let's see what their local franchise is like. And boom. Mitch Grizzard! How will Tina and Laura respond to their former boss being a well-funded corporate competitor? Can Office 365 help them compete as they begin to reach out for customers? Be sure to tune in next time to The Office Show. So I know you need to do, um, the stuff. <laughs> Pretty in pink. Open today, but yeah. on any of the right software tools to do all the behind the scenes stuff. <laughs> yeah, it's too bad. Hey, 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 oh. okay, look.
So cloud, <laughs> hey, hey, hey. <laughs> what about Word and PowerPoint and Exchange? And I've got really good shampoo. I'm gonna have to eat it. Can't afford it. Boom. Okay, huh? Great. Okay. Oh. <laughs>